hello guys uh welcome to this video um let's look at activity 18e the question says open the file saved in activity 18d produce a new extract from all the data in the stationary table that contains a new field called profit which is calculated at run time this field will subtract the purchase price from the sale price contains a new field called percent to calculate the percentage profit for each car at runtime so this field will divide profit by the sale price the next one is contains a new field called unit profit this field will divide the profit by the quantity okay to divide the profit by the quantity for each calculated field show how you perform the calculation and results and the, the result of the calculation okay now i've already um, kind of written out the formula that is going to be used so to solve this problem i'm going to show you two ways this can be done all right so i'm going to show you two ways this can be done so let's move ahead so let's go to our database so i've got uh most of my activities and tasks here so this is activity 18d here so i'm just going to actually let me just click on it and then Control c Control v to duplicate that particular database so now when i duplicate that i'm going to just remove the copy and then of course make it activity 18e and of course the stationary query means that this query was gotten from the stationary table okay so that's why I'm, I'm leaving it there so i'm just going to okay that and then go ahead and open the activity 18e okay so this is what we have so you want to go to the design view of this query so this is a query obviously okay and then here you want to um create your calculated field right okay so the first one will be s prize minus p prize okay this time around we want to use the builder the builder icon here okay so you want to make sure that your cursor is blinking on this next empty column and then click on builder you want to go to your database here click on that uh plus sign and then get down to your query what you want to do you want to use actually your activity 18e query to be able to do this okay so profit 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 is going to be calculated by dividing, so I'm sorry, uh, S price minus P price. So S price, where's S price here? I have S price here, but there's no P price. Okay, there's no P price here. So what you need to do is to go back, make sure that you, you call in the field into this query from this table, right? So I'm going to have, uh, so I have S price here, so I need to bring in P price. So I'm just going to double click on it. And then click on the next um, column again and then make sure that you save your changes please make sure you change your changes so that this p price will reflect in the builder okay so i'm just going to go back to builder and then go to my database and then go to query i'm interested in activity 18 um e table so you want to have s price minus p price so s price you want to double click on that and then have your minus sign from your keyboard and then p price okay and then you can okay that so when you've created this now you will see that access will give it experiment one or yes expression one basically that's what it's called right so let me just expand it a little bit okay so you want to remove the expression one you want to have profit okay so this is one way of doing that so make sure that the colon is still there don't remove the the, the colon is my is my spelling correct profits good so i can run that and then, then see that my profit is here okay so profit will be s price minus the p price and then we'll have this right so one thing i need to do is to actually format that the profit let me format it to euros to be consistent euros and then you want to make the decimal places to be two 
and then close that and then run it one more time now what i'm going to do here it is important that every change that you apply you save so that it does not it does not um, affect the next operation or something like that okay so that is for calculating the profit at runtime now the next one will be the percent now i'm going to also show you a method you can use right percent will be profit over s price so we want to go back to an, to an empty colon next to profit you want to go to builder we'll go to our our query our query table you want to click on it to make sure that the the, the field that you need are on the expression category by the right okay so percent is going to be profits over divide by s price so profit where is profit here this is profit and then divide from your keyboard s price double click on that and then that will be applied s price yes okay so what i'm going to do here is at the back here i'm going to have percent i'm just going to have write percent and then make sure you have a colon after that so the colon will tell access that a um a formula is coming in all right so you can okay that so once you okay that all your calculations will be done and then you don't have to change expression one everything will just go in here immediately okay so we can run this this is percentage and then of course it's in some decimal place okay so this is what we have here so you can go ahead to format this percent so making sure that your cursor is blinking on that particular uh, field row and then in, in, in this column and then you want to go to property sheet you want to go to format i want to take it to uh, percent you want to choose percent from this format and then make sure that it is in zero decimal place actually if you want to make it two decimal places fine but i'm going to keep mine in zero decimal place and then you're going to have your percent here okay good so that's for that so the next method i'm going to um show you is how to type everything uh you know type everything instead of going to the builder right now so this is unit price so what i'm going to do the next available column so you want to write um unit price unit price here sorry is it unit price or unit profit what what is that unit profit sorry unit uh, profit and then colon and then you want to open a square bracket so the unit profit is going to be profit divided by quantity so i'm going to have profit make sure your spellings are correct profit and then close this divide so you want to have forward slash and then open another square bracket and then you want to write quantity quantity so make sure that your spellings are correct if your spellings are not correct to reference the field so where's quantity here so this is quantity here so if it doesn't ref if you can't reference the field you, you probably will get an error so let me run that and then see that my unit my unit profit is already that's been calculated which is um um profit divide by um quantity okay so that's what it is okay so let's also format this let's format the unit uh, profit to currency value so you want to click on uh, property sheet and then go to format here and then making sure it is in euro and then of course two decimal places okay all right close that save your changes and then run that and then see that it has changed to euro okay so i think um that's about it so that is how to um do this particular uh, particular activity and then calculating fields at runtime in your query okay if you have any question or any contribution uh, anything that you saw that i missed please leave a, leave a comment down below so that others will also benefit from this all right thank you so much guys i will see you in the next one